Welcome back. Joining me now is Jacob from Tyler Junior College, and they've got an upcoming performance of Legally Blonde. Good morning. Morning. How are you doing? I am wonderful. Good. So tell me a little bit, it's been a little while since I've seen the movie, kind of give a refresher on the story and kind of why you guys picked this production. Sure, so um, Legally Bond was, uh, came out the movie, it was a novel first, the movie came out in the early 2000s. Um, it follows a young sorority girl that um, has plans to be um, rich and, and beautiful and she ends up uh, her boyfriend runs off to Harvard and she wants to get him back and she uh, works hard to enroll in Harvard to get a law degree to meet him and in that journey she discovers that uh, through practicing law she can help people and really falls in love with helping people uh, instead of chasing just the vanity uh, that she was in uh, her sorority career so um, that's the musical is is following basically the, a lot of the stuff that you saw in the movies for folks that have seen the movie um, uh, part of the reason I chose this I really uh, like the idea of uh, going from very selfish uh, to selfless um, I like that kind of morale that it teaches um, and so uh, that's kind of why we went with it. Okay, well tell us um, who is your blonde then? Well, uh, it's a young girl that is not blonde, oh. naturally. Uh, <laughs> she's from White House. Her name is Eva Hamlet. Um, she's wonderful. Uh, she, she really blew us away at auditions and uh, she's doing a, an amazing job. Yeah, and I know it's not just the people on, you know, the stage. It's everyone behind the scenes making it happen, kind of like you, but kind of tell us a little bit about the produ production team with this. Yeah, so um, one of the, the things that is kind of odd with us um, for what TJC normally does is that we've put this together in four and a half weeks, um, the way that our semester started. Um, it just happened a lot quicker than, than normal. Um, uh, there are four faculty members at TJC that uh, do the production side of theater. Um, on this particular production, I designed the scenery and the lighting, um, and then uh, Denise Weatherly Green did the costumes. Uh, and then we have a lot of help. We, we empower our students to be leaders, and we had lots of students that have done the properties and stuff. Um, we've just done it in an abbreviated time. Yeah. I was painting just before I came here this morning. So uh, <laughs> it, it's been fun. It's been um, really good within our department. The other thing that's really awesome about what we do at TJC is that we've had the music department involved uh, heavily. Uh, Charles Prater is the music director. Um, we have professional musicians with the live orchestra and Dr. Uh, Eddie Earhart is the conductor uh, and working with Carolyn Hanna as choreography. And so it's a real uh, kind of campus wide production. Yeah, well, are there major differences between the movie and the production? Well, sure. The, the biggest one is that there's songs, and so yes. they're singing uh, uh, songs, and uh, a lot of them are, are really catchy. I think that people that, that like the movie are going to really enjoy um, the songs and how they um, kind of add to what they're, what they're used to. Um, but basically, the story, if you know the, the um, movie, it, it follows pretty closely to what the movie is. Any sneak peek of what the next production will be? The next production is a play called Crimes of the Heart. Uh, okay. It deals with uh, sisters coming back to uh, having been around each other for a while and coming back to deal with a family member that is uh, ailing and kind of their drama, their history of how they grew up and how they reconnect and um, yeah, it's a fun journey. Fun. Well, we will get all the information about how to get tickets and everything over on our website. That is KETK.com.